Jerome Pompelone versus Faris Chevalier. So um, yeah, to those who don't know, uh, Pompelone and uh, Chevalier recently fought over in Australia in the undercard of the uh, Justice Uni fight. Um, we're not gonna lie. I came. I just got home uh, not long ago, in hope, in hopes, hoping to uh, find a, a stream for this event, but I couldn't find it. Couldn't find it. I guess it's not popular enough for somebody to stream it from Australia. I don't know, uh, or maybe I just don't have the uh, the right uh, resources to be able to watch this event. But but yeah, I just read some articles when it comes to this fight. Um, and based off of the articles that I've read, it looked like it was a pretty good win from Jerome Papillon, who, by the way, the judges gave pretty, uh, dominantly, uh, but just looking at the scorecards, 100 to 90, 99, 91, 99, 91. So two judges basically just gave one round to, uh, Chevalier. So, so yeah, uh, I can't really put too much input on this fight or give my opinion that much on this fight but I assume um, Pampelone was able to box and outwork and outpoint Jer uh, Chevalier um, yeah again I can't really add much <laughs> I wish I could have seen at least some clips of it I can't even find clips of it on social media like what's going on here man i thought this event was popular over in in australia am i am i wrong or am i wrong um i'm sorry you guys i'm, I'm so tired uh <laughs> oh man i don't know ah, my eyes are burning too i need i need some sleep so anyway good win for uh, mr pampelone who uh now improves to 15 and 0 box rec has yet to update it because the fight happened uh, less than an hour ago at the time of making this video. So I guess BoxRec will take a while to update. Uh, but now Pampelone is 15-0. and 0, 8 wins coming by way of Nakar TKO. He successfully defended his IBF uh, light, IBF Australian light heavyweight title. Um, wait, no, actually he won it. He won the light heavyweight title. He won the cruiserweight one when he fought Francis. Huh, I thought he was defending it. Okay. So, uh, with this win, I'm sure he's going to move up in the rankings. I mean, right now on box rec, he's currently ranked number 77 out of 1,161 boxers here on box rec. So, I think with this win, it might move him uh, at least a couple spots, a few up, a few spots up. Uh, it's just a matter of, you know, stepping up your game and fighting uh, better opponents. And I'm sure eventually he will be in there in you know a big a big fight hopefully in the next couple of years as for chevalier um you know he had a good win against ronald quinlan um he had a close fight against connor wallace uh i guess in this case i guess uh Pampelon was just that much better of a boxer compared to chevalier because i remember i think going into this fight I, I expected more from chevalier um but I guess, uh, and plus he also had a big win against uh, Blake Caparello. But like I said, I guess Jerome was just that much better of a boxer compared to Chevalier. So, anyway, if you saw the fight, let me know what do you think about it or what did you think about it. And if you have a link for the fight, put it down in the comment section below and maybe I'll check it out at a later date. And, uh, and yeah, good job, good win to Mr. Jerome Pampelone. Thanks for listening, thanks for watching, and like always, have a great day. Alright, thanks.